Well, Jalal Rabani is the son of the late Afghan president, Baranuddin Rabani. He joins me live from Ottawa in Canada. Um, Jalal Rabani, how significant is this call by the Taliban that they have the security plans for that meeting, the lawyer Jirga? I mean, do you believe the Taliban? And what would they be trying to achieve uh, by announcing they had the plans anyway? I do believe that uh, the Taliban have been very effective in uh, making sure that their point is uh, 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 gotten across. Uh, they have been uh, able to assassinate uh, prominent figures in Afghanistan. And uh, the fact that uh, they claim that they have uh, the security plans and the names of the people does not really change anything uh, on the reality on the ground. But uh, uh, I'm uh, also uh, hoping that the uh, Afghan government knows what it's doing and uh, taking care of uh, the security matters that uh, they are holding a uh, 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 that is bringing uh, important members of the society together. Um, one of the topics on the agenda of the lawyer Jirga is whether or not Karzai's government uh, should officially enter peace talks with the Taliban. But we know that's been happening. I mean, your father, Baranuddin Rabani, uh, who was leading uh, those talks, he was the contact person uh, between Karzai's government and the Taliban. He was killed by them recently. Um, does this show the Taliban can't be trusted? I mean, should they really be brought into the political arena in Afghanistan? It is a known fact that the Taliban are not interested in talking uh, peace with the government or the international community. Uh, we can't be uh, uh, hoping that one day they do accept the offers of the government and uh, come and uh, negotiate on the uh, peace uh, table. Uh, they don't want to be part of the international community. They don't want to be part of the modern society. It is clear in their actions, their policies, and the destruction and the assassination of the uh, Afghan leaders and the uh, destruction of the Afghan nation. Um, let me get a final thought from you in terms of uh, what the lawyer Jirga is all about. I mean, many people uh, oppose the lawyer Jirga because they say uh, the sorts of topics that they're discussing should actually be discussed and debated in Parliament and not amongst a kind of random group of elders and officials. I mean, these decisions made at the Jirga are not legally binding anyway. But, I mean, is this a group of people selected by Karzai's government, as most people say it is? Absolutely. This is uh, a correct uh, uh, analysis and information. Uh, the, the government, unfortunately, always uses this kind of jirgas uh, to their benefit uh, and to uh, uh, consult with the Afghan people, but not through the right uh, representatives. Uh, we always wonder that uh, what is the uh, use and the uh, work of the Afghan parliament. The Afghan parliament has been uh, there for many years, and uh, if they are the representatives of the people, then what are these uh, traditional uh, jirgas that have not been uh, proven effective in the uh, peace and political process in Afghanistan? All right, uh, Jalal Rabani uh, there in Ottawa, Canada. Thank you very much indeed.